Well, here he is, the top scorer in the league, the main feature of our match today, and it's live. Welcome to you all to this always intriguing game, but it might have another element to it today. I'm Martin Tyler. Alan Smith, I'll pose that question to you. What about the snow? Yes, it's, it's coming down quite heavily at the moment. I'm not sure whether that's going to continue, but it can be a problem for the players actually to see the ball. The old orange ball might be out before long. The match today is Newcastle United against Arsenal. Well, it's almost like your day, Alan, with Arsenal, the highest-scoring team in the league. You must be pleased with that. Yeah, maybe they'd fancy themselves to grab one or two here, the form that the strikers have been in. A real opportunity to analyse Arsenal. Well, I think they've played some really good football this season and uh, their position in the table at the top of the table reflects that. It's just a question of keeping it going now. Newcastle United's lineup. Federico Fernandez starts despite looking shaky in recent games. John Joe Shelby starts looking to recover his true form and they just go with the one striker up front. This is the Arsenal lineup. It's a real group mentality in this lineup about pressing the opposition into making mistakes and cashing in on it straight away. Well, it takes a lot of energy, a lot of motivation. It's easy to drop off, and when you do drop off that really aggressive closing down, that's when it can fall down. Arsenal, a good side they look at the moment. They won away their last game against Cardiff City. Yeah, it was a good 1 0 victory that. I'm um, not sure they can get another one. I think it might be a draw. It's the kickoff and it's Newcastle United who are on the ball. We've given it straight to the opposition. Nacho Monreal. Aubameyang. Going forward well. Newcastle go in and get the ball back. Giroud. Gets his cross in. Well, crossing is a skill and that's not a very good example of it. They've spoilt the promise of that attack. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Giroud. Aubameyang. That's a see your situation, and on he goes. Put in from the wide area. It's a corner for Arsenal here. Corner swung in. Well back! That's a decent header, but not quite good enough. Well, they've got to get tighter to him because he's a really good header of the ball. He showed it there. Matt Ritchie. Neatly intercepted. Well back. will be their throw right. that throw is literally tossed possession away here's a chance to attack the shot's on the home team have some work to do Alan, because they've lost their last two games They've got home advantage, and they need to win today. Yeah, they do, put a pressure on them in front of their own fans, but uh, I fancy them to do it here, actually. Now he's got the ball, what's he going to do with it? Now Mkhitaryan. He's got his shot off now. It's 
Certainly wanting to find a teammate, but he's just found an opponent. Out of play for a throw. Nacho Monreal. Aubameyang. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Still got a bit to do, but this is promising. He's got his tackle in, and the ball's gone out now. Giroud. Now it's Monreal, and in it goes towards the far post. Corner to come now. Just seeing their teams come out, Alan, in this snow. Some players are relishing it, rolling up the shorts, sticking their chests out. Others are shivering a little bit. It's, it's a bit different, isn't it? We used to love training in the snow and uh, having a good fall about, but uh, it's not going to settle so much on the pitch, I don't think, particularly when they get going. The Qatarian's corner, cleared away by the defender. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. Well, that'll be a throw. Aubameyang. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Rodriguez. Some options now for the pass. John Joe Shelby. And here's the shot. Oh, it's come off the goalkeeper, still in play. It's one back. And that ball belongs to the goalkeeper. Some stop that Martin to, to keep his team level, but if uh, this match continues in the same vein, it's only a matter of time for me before he is beaten. Lost the ball there, Arsenal. Matt Ritchie. Well, he saw the guy could switch the play to and came up with the pass as well. Excellent. Corner for Newcastle United. Listen to that roar. They see this is a great chance to go ahead. Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang on the team sheet, but not really in the match at all. It's been very frustrating for him to this point. Well, I feel sorry for him to a certain extent because he's been pulling into little spaces, little oh, gaps, but he hasn't received the ball at the right time. And uh, with the scores level, that's been a shame for his team. Maybe the cross. It's a very good interception. Well, we're halfway through, and we haven't yet got a goal to bring to you. Nil-nil at half-time. It's been only partially impressive from Arsenal, not as good as the facts and figures tell you that they can be, and that's reflected on the scoreline, which is level at the break. No, it's a bit of a collector's item so far, but still, 45 minutes, you'd expect that to change. Now the second period, the second half is underway. Sung Young Ki. Lost the ball. Giroud. Danny Welbeck. Here is Rodriguez. Neatly intercepted. Was good progress with this attack. And now the shot! Absolutely no trouble for the goalkeeper here. Some transfer information just to give you to confirm the deal you might have read about earlier. Edin Dzeko has signed for Paris Saint-Germain. Well, 35 million or thereabouts isn't a small figure, but uh, loads of potential with this lad. Oh, time to get the cross now. Well, one pass away from being a great move. It's an Arsenal substitute who's getting ready. Arsenal give it away. Matt Ritchie. Plenty of width for the team to attack into. Here's the chance. And it's going to be a goal kick.
Mesut Ozil. Mohamed El Neni. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. Good width in the attack here, looking for a cross at the end of it. Can put them in front here, and he's done just that. Oh, they've laid down a marker with that goal. Really good finish. Superb goal here. Well, it was a great delivery into the box from that left-hand side. It's where they look dangerous. Well, they want to see this again, this goal. So, to confirm, Arsenal are ahead. De Paul. John Joe Shelby. Arsenal about to make a change. Mesut Ozil. Mohamed El Neni. Rodriguez. Sung Young Ki. Cher. De Pau. It might be caught. And here's the shot. A real miscue here. <laughs> El Neni. Lacazette. Mohamed El Neni. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Sung Young Ki. Oh, listen to the atmosphere in here. Fans doing their bit to spur their team on for this equaliser. And here they are on the attack. Whipped in from the wide area. Defender caught in possession. Now maybe a chance. And the goalkeeper's got to collect the ball for a goal kick. Nacho Monreal closing him down. So not much time left at all. What does this mean, Alan, for their next game? Well, Newcastle United go up against Crystal Palace after this. Well, nobody's played well for them. They've got to do better. Black and white striped shirts, wherever you look around the ground, it's the ones wearing those colours on the pitch that the fans are a bit concerned about at the moment. They still trail in these closing minutes. Yeah, it can be hard to play in front of this crowd, and the players, by the looks of it, are finding it difficult. Well, the clock is ticking on, two minutes of play left. A chance to break away now on the counter. Going forward well. Two minutes of any time. Share. Here's the chance to get in the cross. Couldn't hold on to the ball. Still pressing for this equalising goal. They forced the corner. And in it goes. Well, that's good defending. Lacazette. And there it is, game over. And Arsenal are the winners. It was really close, right up to the final whistle. But they've got across the finishing line with their noses just in front. I'd be relieved about that because the opposition pushed them all the way. It was a cracking contest. Another good result. They needed to get some goals to do it, the visitors. But they keep on going. Yeah, well, maybe they'll take that away from home. They didn't play as well as they have been. It wasn't a big one, but it was an important one.